Thanks to the dream and will of exceptional men, a unique place is born in the south of Paris in the aftermath of the First World War, the Cité Internationale Universitaire de Paris. Since the 1920s, many countries have built foundations here in order to welcome students and researchers. Today, this real-life utopia is a small society of nations that brings together more than 10,000 residents representing 127 nations from around the world. Built in 1931, the Hellenic Foundation is an impressive neoclassic building in the heart of Paris, designed by architect Nikolaos Zakos in the image of a Greek temple. Thanks to distinguished politicians and the generosity of Greece and its diaspora, Greece successfully achieved its goal of creating a place for Greek students to live and study in the City of Light. Unique in the world and located in the Verdant Cité Universitaire Park, this historic site is home to more than 100 students and researchers from all walks of life who stay for several months or years working and creating together in a friendly and interactive environment. The Hellenic Foundation boasts 80 rooms and hosts talent from all over the world. Jules, Omaha, Nebraska. The shared spaces in the foundation, its salon and its library offer today, as in the past, a shared environment. Uh, Living in the foundation and sharing in its daily life is an unforgettable experience for its residents. The house offers an atmosphere conducive to study and reflection. It encourages bonds of friendship, shared moments and common experiences. Living in the foundation means being part of a living history, written day by day by the women and men who call it home. It means belonging to an ideal community that connects its residents today with those of yesterday who have left their mark on its doorsteps. The foundation, a place of life and creation, is also a place of memories. Since the 1930s, the Foundation has welcomed eminent figures of the arts and the sciences. Dionysius Zakynthinos, Emmanuel Criaras, and Nicolas Spiridakis marked the intellectual life of the Foundation from their debuts in the 30s. In 1946, the Foundation and the Cité welcomed French Institute scholars who arrived aboard the Mataroa, Costas Axalos, Cornelius Castoriadis, Manos Zacharias, Yogos Potamianos, Constantinos Andreu, Eleni Stathopoulou, and many others. Later on, Costa Gavras, Theo Angelopoulos, Dimitris Mitaras, and Yogos Kouropos all lived and created in the house. The current residents of the Foundation are part of this same community of women and men who, with remarkable continuity throughout the years, continue to pen its near centennial history from Greece to Paris. It invites young scholars from Greece to live in a multicultural environment as world citizens, sharing in the values of the Cité's founders, peace, solidarity and friendship. Today, the Hellenic Foundation is carrying out an ambitious project for the renovation of its rooms, supported by the Stavros Niarchos Foundation, the Leventis Foundation, and many other public and private patrons. The Hellenic Foundation needs you, so its work is ensured in the years to come. If you are an individual, you can make your contribution by adopting a room in your name. If you are a company or a foundation, you can contribute the amount of your choice. <laughs>